Hey everyone, it's James from Fun Foods, and today I'm gonna show you how to make these chocolate peanut butter Halloween explosion cookies. Now, these are amazing. I call them explosion cookies because it's just like exploded with a whole bunch of Halloween sweets all in one cookie. It's a lot of fun, so keep watching, and I'll show you step by step how to make these. So, here's what you need to make this recipe you're gonna need some peanut butter, some sugar, an egg, you're also gonna need some cocoa powder. Then you're gonna need some candies of your choice, and what I'm choosing is some candy corn because it's Halloween, some Reese's Pieces, some sprinkles that are Halloween sprinkles, and some white chocolate morsels. And that's what we're gonna use, so let's get started. So the first thing we need to do is start off with a large bowl, and to that I'm gonna add one cup of creamy peanut butter, one cup of sugar, one large egg, and about a fourth a cup of cocoa. Now we just want to mix this until everything's well combined. When that's all well combined, we're done with our beater, so what I'm going to do is just uh, knock out all that batter that's in there with a wooden spoon. Now we can put in about a fourth a cup of these white chocolate morsels. Also about a fourth a cup of Reese's Pieces. Some Halloween sprinkles. And of course, it wouldn't be Halloween unless we have some candy corn in there. Now just mix this until everything's well combined. Actually, I do recommend using your hands. Once our batter is mixed in there with all that candy and all that goodness, we are going to actually put it on a cookie sheet. So it's hard to do because it does, it's a real flaky batter. It's not a real um, moist batter. So we're going to grab some and probably again use your hands for the most part. And we'll just ball it up. Put it on our baking sheet. Alright, so these were an absolute pain to form together and that's because it's, it's quite dry. If I were to do it over again, I'd put another egg in there. So you might want to try that. Use two eggs instead of one and it should work out a lot better than mine. Now we're gonna bake this in the oven at 350 degrees for about 10 minutes. All right, so our cookies took about 12 minutes in the oven at 350 degrees. You did see some melting here of our little candy corns. That's okay. It's gonna melt in our mouth anyway. So I think they cooked up nicely. They were a little uh, thick, so that's why it took about 12 minutes. Um, we're gonna let them cool down and then we'll serve them up. Well, now it's time for the taste test. Here is the moment of truth. We're going to try out our chocolate peanut butter Halloween explosion cookies, and uh, I'm going to give it a go here. Mm. It almost tastes like a dry fudge. I hope that <laughs> explains it. it. It's like a chocolate fudge, but it doesn't, it's not as wet. It's like a dry fudge is the best way I can explain it. It's good. Chocolate peanut butter, like a chocolate peanut butter fudge. Mmm. It's good. Give it a try. Well, thanks everyone for watching. I hope you enjoyed watching me make these chocolate peanut butter Halloween explosion cookies. It was a lot of fun making these. If you enjoyed this, make sure you hit that big thumbs up. 
Also, hit that big red subscribe button if you're not already subscribed to get new videos all the time. And for the whole month of October, I'll be doing a video every single day, a Halloween recipe, of course. So check out some of the videos I have off to the side, as well as a Halloween playlist. And then I will see you guys tomorrow.